Rise and shine, Mr. Freeman. Rise and shine. Not that I wish to imply you have been sleeping on the job. No one is more deserving of a rest, and all the effort in the world would have gone to waste until... Well, let's just say your hour has come again. The right man in the wrong place can make all the difference in the world. So wake up, Mr. Freeman. Wake up and smell the ashes. I didn't see you get on. Welcome to City 17. You have chosen, or been chosen, to relocate to one of our finest remaining urban centers. I thought so much of City 17 that I elected to establish my administration here, in the citadel so thoughtfully provided by our benefactors. It's all I have left. I've been proud to call City 17 my home. the only ones on that train? And so, whether you are here to stay or Passing through on your way to parts unknown. Welcome to City 17. It's safer here. They're always full. No one ever gets on, but they're always they're always departing, but they never arrive. Wait a minute. Where are you taking it? Their brain again. I was hoping I'd seen the last of him in City 14. I wouldn't say that too loud. This is amazing. Welcome. Welcome to City 17. You have chosen, or been chosen, to relocate to one of our finest remaining urban centers. I thought so much of City 17 that I elected to establish my administration here. Just like everybody else. that beer I owed you. It's me, Gordon. Barney from Black Mesa. Hey, sorry for the scare. I had to put on a show for the cameras. I've been working undercover with civil protection. I can't take too long or they'll get suspicious. I'm way behind on my beating quota. Yes, Barney, what is it? I'm in the middle of a critical test. Sorry, Doc, but look who's here. Great Scott! Gordon Freeman! I expected more warning. Yeah, you and me both, Doc. He was about to board the express to Nova Prospect. Well, Barney, what do you intend? I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Alex is around here, somewhere. She would have a better idea how to get him here. Oh, as long as he stays away from checkpoints, we should be okay. Listen, I gotta go, Doc. We're taking enough chances as it is. Very well. And, uh, Gordon? Good to see you. Okay, Gordon. You're gonna have to make your own way to Dr. Kleiner's lab. Oh, man, that's what I was afraid of. Get in here, Gordon, before you blow my cover. Pile up some stuff to get through that window and keep going till you're in the plaza. I'll meet up with you later.
Let me read a letter. Dear Dr. Breen, why has the combine seen fit to suppress our reproductive cycle? Sincerely, a concerned citizen. Thank you for writing, concerned. Of course, your question touches on one of the basic biological impulses with all its associated hopes and fears for the future of the species. I also detect some unspoken questions. Do our benefactors really know what's best for us? What gives them the right to make this kind of decision for mankind? Will they ever deactivate the suppression field and let us breed again? to address the anxieties of our concerns, rather than try to answer every possible question. Let us consider the fact that for the first time ever, as a species, Find one. You're a cop. Thank you for writing. He's one of us. Sir. Of course, your question touches on one of the basic biological impulses. With all its associated hopes. This is once I hope you're wrong. The future of the species. I told you they'd be I coming for us next. Detect some unspoken questions. Do our benefactors really know what's best for us? What gives them the right to make this kind of decision for? I can't take it anymore. Everything's gonna be okay. What are we going to do? Attention, residents. Miss Count, detective in your block. Cooperation with your civil protection team. Head for the roof! There's no time to lose! Here they come! <laughs> All citizens in local residential blocks assume your inspection position. Get in here, quick! Keep moving! Get in the room!
Dr. Freeman, I presume. We'd better hurry. The Combine can be slow to wake, but once they're up, you don't want to get in their way. Dr. Kleiner said you'd be coming this way. <laughs> I don't think it occurred to him that you might not have a map. I'm Alex Vance. My father worked with you back in Black Mesa. I'm sure he don't remember me, though. Man, a few words, aren't you? Remember him from Black Mesa? Your old administrator. <laughs> Don't get my dad started on Dr. Breen. Through here. Funny, you showing up on this day in particular. We've been helping people escape the city on foot. It's a dangerous route to my father's lab. Through the old canals. Today, we're finally on the verge of having a better way. <laughs> Here. Let me buy you a drink. Oh, and by the way, nice to finally meet you. Everything all right, Dr. Kleiner? Oh, uh, hello, Alex. Well, uh, almost all right. Lamar has gotten out of her crate again. If I didn't know better, I'd suspect Barney of trapping and... My goodness. Gordon Freeman. It really is you, isn't it? I found him wandering around outside. Bit of a troublemaker, isn't he? We owe a great deal to Dr. Freeman, even if trouble does tend to follow in his wake. I must say, Gordon, you come at a very opportune time. Alex has just installed the final piece for our resurrected teleport. I can't take any credit for the breakthrough, Doctor. Nonsense. Your talents surpass your loveliness. <laughs> Let's just see if this thing works, okay? Well, it's here. There you are. Man, Gordon, you stirred up the hive. We can't keep him here long, Doc. It'll jeopardize everything we've worked for. Don't worry. He's coming with me. That's right, Barney. This is a red letter day. We'll inaugurate the new teleport with a double transmission. You mean it's working? For real this time? Because I still have nightmares about that cat. No, no. There's nothing to be nervous about. What cat? We've made major strides since then. Major strides. What cat? Doc, since he's not taking the streets, you might as well get him out of his civics. What? Oh dear, you're right. I almost forgot. Barney? I'll give you the honor. <laughs> I've got to get back on my shift, but okay. Here we go. Ah! Damn it, get it off me! Lamar, there you are. I thought you got rid of that test. Certainly not. Never fear, Gordon. She's de-beaked and completely harmless. The worst she might do is attempt to couple with your head fruitlessly. Get, what? Get that thing away from me! Here, my pet. Hop up. No, not up there! No! No! Careful, Lamar! Those are quite fragile! Oh, fie! It'll be another week before I can coax her out of there. Yeah, longer if we're lucky. <laughs> Barney! You're not an animal person. <laughs>
Well, Gordon, I see your HEV suit still fits you like a glove. At least, the glove parts do. I've made a few modifications, but I'll just acquaint you with the essentials. Now, let's see. The Mark V hazardous environment suit has been redesigned for comfort and utility. Oh, dear. We don't have time for this. At least get that suit to stuff, Gordon. Good idea. There's a charger on the wall. I've modified your suit to draw power from combine energy outlets, which are plentiful wherever they patrol. Meanwhile, let's get this show on the road. us in. Dr. Freeman proved an able assistant. Let's go ahead and bring Gordon through now. Right you are. Speak to you again in a few moments. Good job, Gordon. Throwing that switch and all. I can see your MIT education really pays for itself. All right, Barney. Your turn. Gee, thanks. Gordon, as soon as we're in we'll send you to Eli's. And not a moment too soon. Initializing in three, two, one. Now, Barney, if you'd be so kind. Good luck out there, Gordon. Yes, indeed. We're ready to project you, Gordon. Bon voyage, and best of luck in your future endeavors. Final sequence. Well, what is it? If you're back, we'll freaking head out for Mark. Let's go!
The Citadel's on full alert. I've never seen it lit up like that. Get out of City 17 as fast as you can, Gordon. Take the old canals, right? They'll get you to Eli's lab. It's, it's a dangerous route, but there's a whole network of refugees, and they'll help you if they can. I'd come with you, but I gotta look after Dr. Kleiner. Oh, and before I forget, I think you dropped this back in Black Mesa. Good luck out there, buddy. You're gonna need it. Protection. 
Good God! Guess those sirens are for you, huh? Good thing you found us. You're not the first to come through here by all- This is the free man. The Combine's reckoning has come. Look, we're just a lookout for the Underground Railroad. Main station's right around the corner. They'll get you started on the right foot. Meanwhile, let my Vortigaunt friend here give you a jolt to get you going. Be careful now. Civil protection catches you down here. It's bad news for the whole railroad. We say, we say, we say. Okay. Community. Unrest procedures code is now in effect. In pacify. Code. Now, I'm going to 
Protection team alert. Evidence of anti-civil activity in this community. Code. Assemble. Clap. Contain. Citizen reminder. Inaction is conspiracy. Report counter behavior to a civil protection team immediately. Attention. Evasion behavior consistent with malcompliant defendant. Ground protection team. Alert. Code. Isolate. Expose. Administer. Attention. Community. Our draft procedure code is now in effect. Keep going, friend. That station was raided, but there's others up ahead.
Clearing up the railroad, covering our tracks. Looks like you're gonna be the last one through. Be glad you're not the guy they're looking for. Sounds like they're calling in every CP unit in City 17. Now they're flooding the areas up ahead with manhacks. You better get going before they sweep through here. Oh shit! Too late! Close call. Look, it isn't safe here. I'll give you some supplies to keep you going, and you really gotta go. Thank you. 